Welcome to Autobike Focus, the channel where we explore the most iconic machines of land, sea, and sky. While we are known for covering motorcycles and automotive legends, today we turn to the skies to discuss a project that has captured the imagination of aviation enthusiasts around the globe. The 2026 Mikoyan MiG-41. This next-generation stealth interceptor is designed to replace Russia's formidable MiG-31 Foxhound, and it represents a bold leap forward in aerospace technology. Often referred to as the PAC-DP program, the MiG-41 is not only an evolution, but also a radical rethinking of what an interceptor should be in the age of hypersonic threats, advanced stealth, and global competition in air dominance. Origins of the project the MiG-41 traces its roots back to the Cold War era, when the Soviet Union relied on the MiG-25 and later the MiG-31 to defend its vast northern airspace. These interceptors were designed to counter fast, high-flying threats, including American bombers and reconnaissance aircraft. However, as technology evolved, the MiG-31 began to show its age. By the 2010s, Russian military planners initiated discussions about a successor. The MiG-41, or PAC-DP, Prospective Air Complex for Long-Range Interception, emerged as the answer. Officially acknowledged in the mid-2010s, it was envisioned as a sixth-generation interceptor capable of engaging targets at hypersonic speeds and even operating in near-space environments. Design Philosophy The design philosophy of the MiG-41 centers on speed, range, and stealth. Unlike multi-role fighters, which are jacks of all trades, the MiG-41 is envisioned as a specialized tool, an aircraft built to intercept strategic bombers, reconnaissance platforms, and hypersonic weapons. It is expected to retain the large size and endurance of its predecessor, the MiG-31, but with a stealthier profile, advanced radar-absorbing materials, and cutting-edge propulsion systems. Its silhouette, based on early concepts, suggests a sleek fuselage with reduced radar cross-section, optimized for supersonic and hypersonic flight regimes. Performance Expectations Performance is where the MiG-41 is expected to shine. Reports suggest a top speed of Mach 4 to Mach 4.3, comma, far surpassing the MiG-31's Mach 2.8 capability. Some sources even speculate about experimental engines that might push performance into the hypersonic regime. Approaching Mach 5, such speed would make the MiG-41 one of the fastest aircraft ever conceived, capable of outrunning or outmaneuvering nearly any airborne adversary. In addition to raw speed, the MiG-41 is rumored to have a combat radius exceeding 700 miles, ensuring it can cover Russia's enormous airspace with fewer aircraft. Pulsion System To achieve such performance, the MiG-41 is believed to incorporate next-generation turbofan or ramjet propulsion. Concepts include variable cycle engines that can operate efficiently at subsonic speeds for patrol missions and then switch to ramjet or scramjet modes for hypersonic interception. The challenge lies in balancing speed with reliability, as engines operating at Mach 4 or beyond must withstand extreme temperatures and stresses. Russia's United Engine Corporation is reportedly working on advanced propulsion systems to meet these demands, though details remain classified. Weapons and Armament The MiG-41's role as an interceptor demands a formidable arsenal. Reports suggest it will carry long-range air-to-air missiles, such as an updated version of the R-37M, capable of striking targets at distances over 300 kilometers. In addition, it is expected to be armed with newly developed hypersonic missiles designed to intercept not only aircraft, but also ballistic and cruise missiles traveling at extreme speeds. Some speculation even points toward directed energy weapons, such as lasers, for disabling incoming missiles. This combination of conventional and experimental weaponry ensures that the MiG-41 would remain relevant in the evolving battle space of the mid 21st century. Avionics and sensors. Beyond speed and weapons, the MiG-41 must excel in detection and tracking. It is expected to carry advanced AESA radar systems capable of identifying stealth aircraft and hypersonic threats at extreme ranges. Integrated Infrared Search and Track Systems, IRST, will allow passive detection of targets, reducing reliance on radar emissions that could reveal its position. Networking capabilities will likely be a core feature, 
enabling the MiG-41 to share targeting data with satellites, ground stations, and other aircraft in real time, making it a critical node in Russia's air defense network, stealth, and survivability. Unlike previous Soviet interceptors, which prioritize speed over stealth, the MiG-41 is anticipated to incorporate low observable design features. Its airframe will likely include angular shaping, radar absorbent coatings, and internal weapons bays to reduce radar cross-section. These measures would allow the aircraft to approach targets undetected, especially important when facing adversaries with advanced detection systems. Combined with its ability to fly extreme altitudes and speeds, stealth ensures survivability in environments dominated by next-generation air defense systems, near space capabilities. One of the most intriguing aspects of the MiG-41 program is its rumored ability to operate in near space environments. Some reports suggest the aircraft could reach altitudes exceeding 100,000 feet, enabling it to intercept satellites or high altitude reconnaissance platforms. This would blur the line between conventional fighter aircraft and space planes, giving Russia a strategic edge in anti-satellite warfare. While such claims remain speculative, the idea aligns with Russia's interest in space-based defense and deterrence strategies. Role in Modern Warfare In the 21st century, air warfare is defined by speed, stealth, and electronic dominance. The MiG-41's role fits neatly into this paradigm. Unlike multi-role fighters that handle both ground and air missions, the MiG-41 is a dedicated interceptor, ensuring that Russian airspace remains protected from advanced threats including stealth bombers and hypersonic missiles. Its long-range capability means it could respond rapidly to intrusions across vast distances, reinforcing Russia's strategic defense. Comparison with global rivals. The MiG-41 is often compared to Western sixth-generation projects such as the U.S. Next Generation Air Dominance NGAD program and Europe's FCS initiative. While NGAD focuses on multi-role dominance, the MiG-41 specializes in interception. This specialization gives it a unique role, but also limits its versatility compared to multi-role platforms. However, in terms of raw speed and range, the MiG-41 could surpass its rivals, cementing its place as the ultimate interceptor rather than a general purpose fighter. Challenges and criticisms. As ambitious as the MiG-41 sounds, the program faces serious challenges. Developing engines capable of sustained hypersonic flight is technologically daunting and expensive. Russia's aerospace industry has faced funding issues and delays in past projects such as the Su-57 stealth fighter. Critics argue that the MiG-41 may remain more of a concept than a reality if financial and technical hurdles cannot be overcome. Additionally, the rapidly changing landscape of unmanned systems raises the question of whether a manned hypersonic interceptor is the best investment for future warfare. Timeline and production. The MiG-41 has been under discussion since the mid-2010s, with various prototypes and design studies reportedly underway. By 2026, Russia has hinted at unveiling the first demonstrator models, though full-scale production may still be years away. If successful, the MiG-41 could enter service in the early 2030s, gradually replacing the MiG-31 fleet. Its development timeline will depend heavily on funding, geopolitical priorities, and technological breakthroughs, strategic importance. For Russia, the MiG-41 represents more than just a new aircraft. It symbolized strategic independence and military prestige. By fielding a platform capable of outrunning hypersonic missiles and threatening near space assets, Russia would signal its ability to counter Western technological advances. This deterrent value alone makes the MiG-41 a critical component of Russia's defense strategy, regardless of how many units are eventually produced. The future of interception. The MiG-41 highlights the evolving role of interceptors in modern warfare. Once designed primarily